All right, which one should we break into first? Is it this one? Is it this one? I think we'll go with uh, our buddy Darkrai on, on the front there. Gonna pick this one first. Let's try it out. All right, we opened up the pack. We got our trainer code and we will flip over the first three. And I think that's the trick. All right. First one will be Rock Energy, number two. Right there is Executor. Interesting art on that one. All right, are these upside down? They might be upside down. Let's try again. A Reverse Hollow Dupider. Next one, Fungus. Next one, Salakoth. That's Salakoth. Looks a little hefty there. Maybe because it's lazy. I guess so. Looks skinnier in uh, Pokemon Go. Next up, Drillbur, which is um, my cat's favorite Pokemon because his name's Wilbur. So that's because it rhymes. Simple Man, Litwick. Nice Halloween candle. Been catching a lot of those lately. All right, we got a couple more. Cryogonal, interesting looking guy. Snowflake, maybe. All right, second to last card in the deck is Oranguru. Fun guy, well, not fun guy. Let's see here. Oh, there is a bonus one. Blaine's Quiz Show. And the last but not least, what do we got? We've got the ear ringing bell. And now I can barely hear anything. All right, let's move on to the next one. Okie dokie. I've only opened one Detective Pikachu booster pack and that was from the movie. But now we've got a Bulbasaur, which I did not have until right now, so that's good. We got the Lickitung, which I'm extra happy about because he just looks so happy, and I haven't gotten that one either. And Jigglypuff. I did have that one. Healing Melody. All right, and the Slay King. Look at that guy. I think I might have forgotten that Slay King even came in this pack, but... Um, he kind of looks like he might be related to um, the Planet of the Apes. Apes, I guess you would call them. But, uh, yep, there's that one. Oh, yeah. There's the card. And we will get in on the next ones. Let's go. Up next, Sun and Moon Ultra Prism and one more Detective Pikachu. Here we go. Okay. Let us break into the Ultra Prism Booster Pack. This is actually my first Ultra Prism pack that I've ever broken into. I was going to get a few of them from Michaels and then they decided to cancel the order and refund my money because they didn't actually have it. So Michaels, check your inventory before you let me buy stuff. All right, so let's get into this. All right. There's the card, cold card. Let us go, one dose trace. Let us begin with the cards. We got our green energy, kale of some sort. Oh, what happened there? I think I did it upside down again. We got a lowland sand slash. Look at that card. Nice, cool guy. All right, let's get back into it. Look at that. A nice reverse hollow, I think. Mars, Mars trainer. Looks like a Jetsons. Next up, Cherubi. Young goose, not a fun goose or a fun guy, but a young goose. We've got Scoruppy. We've got Scoruppy and Cherubi. 
a lot of the Ubies. We got Chimchar. We've got Roselia. We've got Bronzong. That's a interesting looking artwork there. We've got Cosmoem. I don't think I've heard of this one before. I've been out of the game a little too long. And last but not least is Cynthia Trainer Card. All right, that does it for the Sun and Moons. So let us get into Detective Pikachu, number two. So long. Okie dokie. Let us get into the code card. And next, with the last four cards of Detective Pikachu, we have another Slay King. And then we've got, ooh, Morlul. Interesting, it looks like a, a planting jellyfish, I suppose. Yeah. Okay, we got one more here. There's the Magikarp. Hold still, Magikarp, hold. Okay, that was enough holding. And last but not least, Jigglypuff. So we got um, a couple duplicates there, but my collection is slowly growing. So let's get into the next batch of cards. All right, so we have got the next pack that I purchased from the register section. And you can already see that we've got the Silvali and the Type Null. And we're gonna break into this pack right now and see if we've got anything good. Let's go. All right. Here is the pack that was in the back. And then, was it the backpack? No. Okay. There's the Silvali, which I put in the sleeve, so I'm not touching the artwork. And then the Type Null here. And then we got the uh, a little a little coin, nice and green and shiny, I suppose. So we'll put that to the side and break into this pack. And I'm pretty sure this has something good in it. I just, I feel like it does. Well, I guess you've already seen that one. We'll put that down. And here's the card. And we'll get you out of the way. All right, ready? Are you ready? Let's go. Green energy, another kale for the pile. We've got Lapras, that's nice. Lapras is definitely one of my favorite Pokemon. I've got the holographic one from 20 years ago and I got a nice shiny one in my other Pokedex. So we'll set that guy to the side. Next up is, whoa a reverse hollow cloister now that is a nice looking card right there so we've got two water and ice to start off and then we've got hoot 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 is sometimes such a hoot but not right now we are not focusing on you next up we've got our mud bray brother our brethren of Mudbray. And then we got Grookey. I love Grookey. And then Krabby. Rookedy. So we've got a lot of birds and water here in this pack. We've got a great ball. Always, always necessary. Getting to the end here. And it's a Corvusquire. Quite, it's definitely another bird. I wanna fly. Anyway, and the last card of this register pack is Dottler. Look at little Dottler. Anyway, that is the register pack. Not too bad for four bucks. 
Boy, was this difficult to open. This thing was shrink wrapped and then shrink wrapped again. If anyone's ever opened one of these things, can you tell me how to open it better next time? Cause wow, was that really difficult? So let's open it up. All right. What do we got here? Ooh. Look at that Blastoise. That's Blastoise. Pretty cool looking. Nice and blue. Second little button of the day. So we have a Sun and Moon deck and a Darkness Ablaze booster pack. And then we've got a little Surf Fetched insert here. Interesting. It's very cardboardy. Let's break in to the packs. We'll start with Sun and Moon. Okay, so we've opened it up. We got the card. Go there. Throw that away to my neighbor. My neighbor is going to be getting a lot of these code cards, and then he's gonna think, oh, this is fun, it's my lucky day, and realize that someone else has already claimed it. But this is a green energy. That is three Kales in a row, and you know what that means. Nothing good for Kale. Okay, now I am excited about this one. The shiny Halloween Crobat. Nice little rare card there. I think I might be opening these a little bit different than I did previous packs. So um, we'll go with, oh my God. Look at that, two cannon. I am so happy with this guy. I now want Fruit Loops. I'm assuming these should have been on the, uh, the end here, but I think I'm opening these a little bit wrong, but it's still a good pull. We've got Zubat, after getting Crobat. We've got Poplio, and then we've got Toga tomorrow. And then Shelder. I'll put that right next to the Hollow Cloister that we pulled a little bit ago. And now we've got Makuhita. He's been at my house for the last two days. And then we've got Tora Cat. And what else do we have here? This is quite a messy opening. I apologize. We have the Energy Switch Trainer card. Yeah, nice one. And we've got a Trumbeak. I think we pulled his evolution a little bit ago. Okay, so that's it. That is it for the cards. It looks like today's uh, today's winners might be these two from the same deck. Very nice and shiny. Two Cannon and Crobat. All right, that is the Pokemon unboxing episode number two.